Welcome or welcome back at the I need help at C squared. In this example, uh, we have a polygon with five sides A, B, C, D, E. Uh, we need to find the, uh, the value of X and the measure of each interior angle. Uh, for that reason, I'm going to use this uh, theorem, which says the sum of the interior angle over polygon with n side is n minus 2 times 180. So in other words, if we take a look here, like I said, we have five sides of pentagon. So the sum of the interior angles will be nothing else than 5 minus 2 times 180, which means 3 times 180, which means 540 degrees. The sum of the interior angle of this polygon is 540 degree. And now we can go to the next stage. We're going to say the measure of angle A plus the measure of angle B plus the measure of angle C plus the measure of angle D plus the measure of angle E. Those five interior angles of this polygon is nothing else than 540 degree. And then we're going to replace all this measure of the angle of the expression given. The measure of angle A is 143 minus 17x. The measure of angle B is 125 degrees. The measure of angle C is 25x. The measure of angle D is 110 degrees. And the measure of angle E is, is 22x plus 12. And all these guys, if we add them together, we get that 540 I mentioned before. And now if we notice, we have to combine like terms. I'm going to start with the axis, 17x, 25x, and 22x. In fact, negative 17x, right? If we combine those guys, we get 30x. And then we have 143 plus 125 plus 110 and plus 12, that is 390 equals 540. In order to solve this equation for x, we're going to subtract 390 on both sides. And we end up with 30x equals 150 and we're going to divide by 30 and we have the x the x is 5 now we can go to the next stage we can find the measure of these interior angles the measure of angle a is uh, like we said at the beginning 143 minus 17 X, so we're going to plug 5 in it for X, and we're going to grab a calculator if we are allowed, and calculate this uh, the measure of this angle. And I end up with 58 degree. The measure of angle A, A is 58 degree. The measure of angle B, it's given to us. We don't have to do anything, so I'm just going to list it here, 125 degree. The measure of angle C is 25x. So we just have to do 25 times 5, and that will be 125 degrees. Measure of angle D, it's also given to us like C, it's 110 degrees. The only one we need also to find out is the measure of angle E, which is 22x plus 12, which means 22 times 5 plus 12, and that will be... 122 degrees and that's it for this problem if you enjoyed this video don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help thank you